Okay, so do you want to see something cool about the Lux Riot? Another cool feature. Uh, so one thing that it should be like a basic stuff for all VMS, but to be honest, no one knows how to make it right except Lux Riot, in my opinion. So the video search and playback. The problem is that usually it takes a lot of time and resources from the uh, from the client station. What you can see here is my my laptop. Uh, I can still go to the, for example, playback, uh, live view. I can display all the cameras and so on, so on. And I can go, of course, to the playback and I can search for the video. So first of all, let's take this five megapixel camera. So yeah, this is it. Mm, let's disable the video analytics. And this is the playback. As you can see here on the bottom, we got the timeline. And what is really nice is that on the timeline, you can zoom in the timeline and zoom out. Even a few months, you can view it like this. When you zoom in, you can see the different colors. The blue one is video analytics. Now video analytics is detecting the car or the person. So I can see that everywhere where there's a blue color, there is probably a car or a human walking, right? The gray one is a motion detection, just motion detection, basic motion detection in a specific area. Uh, of course, I can move the whole timeline, I can view a few days and so on and so on. What else I can show you, the really cool stuff? For example, you want to quickly search the whole timeline and check for the changes. You don't need to use the speed up. Of course, you can do it, right? You can speed up the video, like forward. You can go backward, like what, 20, 128, and looks how smooth it works. But you can also just drag this yellow bar here. I just hope that my screen recording will show you how smooth it is. Look, this is just like time lapse, right? I can check for the changes. I can move it as fast as I want. And still, it's smooth, it's smooth, and it's on my laptop, right? So yeah, this is something that all VMSs should have, but right now it's available in the Lux Triad, so this is the right way, right? Uh, what else? If you want to export this kind of time-lapse, it's also easy in the Lux Triad. You don't need any third-party software, for example, just like export the video and then just use some kind of app or software to make the time-lapse. No, you can go do it directly from the Lux Triad. How? You just go to the settings, video export, you just choose this one, time-lapse. Make the time-lapse for my video. And how many seconds is one second of the video? Let's say... 600 let's try 500 oh, sorry 500 seconds is one second save and now we got like i think four hours video and check this out check how fast it will create this time lapse export video move camera no audio just this one five megapixel we got this time, so it's almost five hours of the video, creating the time-lapse, export. And nothing happened because in the Lux Riot, it will export the video in the background and you can check the exporting here in the library. And as you can see here, yeah, this is the video that I ex exported 200 megabytes in like, I don't know how fast, like five seconds, it's done. Now you can just go here and you can check it out so yeah this is how it works and you get nice smooth time lapse so perfect solution for any i don't know construction site uh, city surveillance some kind of warehouse if you want to just export one whole day to check the i don't know how people work there or how all those trucks are moving and so on so on and this is how you do it yeah easy time-lapse function, easy search function, everything goes smooth and easy. This is the Lux Riot way. So yeah, uh, if you want to see how, what else you can do with the exported video and all other tricks you, we can do it, uh, I will show it in the next episode. And if you got any other questions about the Lux Riot, feel free to ask, just go to the comment sections and leave some kind of comment below. So yeah, thank you. Where is the stop button?